Now we will discuss serial dilution, diluting a stock solution many times in succession by the same factor is known as serial dilution. So guys, whenever we carry out serial dilution, what we are doing is that we are diluting the stock solution in series many times, right? And at each successive dilution, we are reducing the concentration of the solution by the same factor. For example, if you look at this example in front of you, we had a stock solution of 2.0 mole per dm cube sucrose, right? And in the first step, we prepared 1.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution. So what we did, we reduced the concentration by half, right? In the second step, what we are doing that we prepared 0.5 mole per dm cube sucrose solution from 1.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution. So again, the concentration of the solution is reduced to half. In the third step, we prepared 0.25 mole per dm cube sucrose solution using 0.5 mole per dm cube um, sucrose solution. So again, the concentration of the solution is reduced to half, right? So whenever we carry out serial dilution, we carry out successive dilutions and at each step, the concentration of the solution is reduced by the same factor. For example, the concentration can be reduced by half or it can be reduced by 10 times, right? So on that basis, we have two types of serial dilutions. One is 2-4 serial dilution in which at each successive step, the concentration of the solution is reduced by half. And the, in 10-4 serial dilution, what happens is that at each successive step, the concentration of the solution is reduced 10 times right so we will first discuss we will first discuss twofold serial dilution and this type of dilution each successive solution has half the concentration as compared to the previous solution right so how do we actually carry out twofold serial dilution you need to know that for twofold serial dilution the ratio of v1 to d should be 1 is to 1 and if you recall what is v1 v1 is the volume of the stock solution that you use and d is the volume of the distilled water right so for two fold serial dilution v1 to d ratio should be 1 is to 1 for example if i want to prepare 1.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution using 2.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution what i will do is that i will take maybe i will take 5 centimeter cube of 2.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution in 5 centimeter cube of distilled water. You can see that I took V1 and D in equal amounts, right? Do you get this point? The V1 and D should be in equal amounts or should be in 1 is to 1 ratio. If I want to take 2.5 centimeter cube of 2.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution, then I will take 2.5 centimeter cube of distilled water. The volumes V1 and D should be equal. And obviously, uh, whatever volumes you take, V1 and D will add up to form V2, that is the volume of your desired solution, right? That, that we discussed in the previous video of uh, the simple dilution, right? So over here, we prepared 10 centimeter cube of 1.0 mole per dm cube of sucrose solution by uh, adding 5 centimeter cube of 2.0 mole per dm cube sucrose and 5 centimeter cube of distilled water. If you want to prepare in the next step, you want to prepare 10 centimeter cube of 0.5 mole per dm cube sucrose solution. So what you will do, you will now add 5 centimeter cube of 1.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution and 5 centimeter cube of distilled water. So now this is V1 and this is D, right? So if you want to prepare 0.5 mole per dm cube, sucrose solution, you will use 1.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution and not the first one because we are carrying out dilutions in series, right? So you don't use the same stock solution to prepare all, right? You don't do this. You carry out dilutions in series, right? So for example, if this is the first solution, you will use first solution to prepare second. If this is the third solution, you will use second to prepare third. If this is the fourth solution, you will use third to prepare fourth because you're carrying out dilutions in series right and if you want to reduce the concentration by half at each step you need to take v1 and d in the same ratio right let's move on to 10 fold serial dilution 
So in 10 fold serial dilution, what will happen in this type of dilution each successive solution has one tenth the concentration as compared to the previous solution. So in this case, you will use the V1 to D ratio that is one is to nine. So over here, if you have the stock solution of 2.0 mole per dm cube, sucrose, what you will do in the first step, you will reduce the concentration by 10 times. So you will get the concentration 0 0.2 because if you divide 2.0 by 10, what do you get? 0 0.2, right? So this is 10 fold dilution in which at each step, what you will be doing, just focus over here that at each step, you're reducing the concentration by 10 times. So using 2.0, you prepared 0 0.2 and using 0 0.2, you prepared 0 0.02 and using 0 0.02, you prepared 0 0.002. So at each step, the concentration is being reduced by 10 times. And for that, what you need to do is that you need to take V1 and D in a ratio of one is to nine. So for example, if you want to prepare 10 centimeter cube of 0 0.2 mole per dm cube sucrose using 2.0 mole per dm cube sucrose solution, what you need to do is that you need to take one centimeter cube of 2.0 mole per dm cube sucrose and nine centimeter cube of distilled water. The ratio should be one is to nine. If you are taking two centimeter cube of 2.0 mole uh, per dm cube sucrose, then you need to take um, 18 centimeter cube of distilled water. The ratio should be in one is to nine right and if you want to now prepare 10 centimeter cube of 0 0.02 mole per dm cube sucrose using 0 0.2 mole per dm cube sucrose again you have to take the volumes in 1 is to 9 ratios so for, so for example you will take uh, 1 centimeter cube of the stock solution that is the v1 so v1 should be 1 centimeter cube for example 1.1 1 .1, uh, centimeter cube of 0 0.2 mole per dm cube sucrose and 9 centimeter cube of distilled water right this is the d right so you will do it like this and uh, if you take two centimeter cube over here this should be 18 right so i hope um, the dilution was clear to you if you have any queries you can um, let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching allah is everyone